What is going on guys? It's your boy Chris Cage coming at you two times back with another weekly race video. Today, we got the race crate out. And, we're, and what we're going to be doing is a fatal four-way race. Now for today's fatal four-way race, we're going to be using Strictly Hot Wheels. And they're going to be within four different brands. Realistic, Fantasy, Character Cars, and Real Riders. Yes, four different um, um, brands of Hot Wheels, even though they're not brands because they're all one brand. But four groups of Hot Wheels cars that are going to take to the track, all to become the undisputed winner. And that will be all there is to it. It's not necessarily a king race because this is not really a king style format where we just race and race until we have one winner. Or, well, not really one winner, but like one almighty winner that we can crown king. This is just a race to see who is the best team out there. That's it. Nothing else. So now it is time to start the first round as we begin to pick four cars from these four especially marked boxes. Well, they're not marked, but you get what I mean. Round one starts right now. All right, guys, it's time for round number one. So, so you know the drill. It's time to pick some cars. Nice. It's Lee in a seven. Twenty four hours. We got Ghost Rider Char Ghost Rider Charger and Kylo Ren. It's time to start racing, folks. Cars are all lined up and it's ready to race. All right, lane number four, and it goes to 24 hours. Congratulations on getting a win. All right, now it's time to pick the next four. I forgot what this car is already. I think it's called Maleficent. Golf GTI. Ooh, look at this bone sugar right here. And yes, apparently, some sites have not posted this yet, but some people have seen this before. That's in 240Z. It's time to get to racing. It's time to see which one of these four are going to win. Lane number two, and it's going to go to Maleficent. Time to go picking for the next four. Got ourselves a Nova. So fast, the Joker. Porsche 997 GT3. Of course, it's the 911 GT3, but who cares? There's a whole bunch of 911s out there, so I gotta call them by, by their generation. So yeah. Time to start racing. Alright, the cars are lined up and they're ready to race. 
Forza. That was so blurry, I didn't catch anything. But we do know that lane number four is going to be going to so fast because he's literally so fast because he won it. Time to start picking the next four. Shall be Cobra Daytona Coupe. I don't have this in Forza Horizon 4 yet, even though it costs 8 million credits. We have the Skyline GTR BNR32. I really thought this was going to be a red edition, but not. Oh, and by the way, I just got this uh, today. I'm filming this on Friday, by the way, if those y'all are wondering. Ray special with them black walls and also Praetorian Guard. Who do you think is going to win it? It's time to get racing. Going to lane number two here. Praetorian Guard wins one for the character cars. All right, y'all, it's time to pick the next four. Thor. Number six, four, Taurus Stalker. How about this guy right here? The 67 Ford Mustang in Zamac. And finally, Speed Shark. Let's race. The guys are lined up and they're ready to race. Let's get it on. I didn't catch that one single thing. But we do know that the trigger reads number two. So that means whoever was in lane two got the win. And that is Thor. Alright guys, it is time now to pick the next four. We got ourselves a express lane. 57 Chevy. Look at the detail of this car. My goodness. And finally, GT Racer. And then the Joker GT. Let's race. Time to see who will win it. Lane number three. And a realistic car finally crosses the line. And the winner is going to be the 57 Chevy. Congratulations. You already know what's going down here, partner. We got to pick four more cars. Indy 500 Oval, Porsche 962, nice, I like that car, plus, look at that, add fan gang, split in image 2, and the first order executioner. Time to see who will win it. 
Who's gonna win it? Oh, I saw a block move being put on, but it, it goes to lane number four, which in turn is... Oh, whoa, the Indy 500 Ofo. We got your next four ready. Rising Heat, 2005 Ford Mustang GT. Skeleton and Chad Little. Time to see who will win it. This is a promising field, but only one can cross the line. Lane number two goes to Skeleton. Time to pick the next four. Black Widow. We have another GP 2009 here. Porsche 356A Speedster. I think that's on fours. I'm gonna, I'm, um, I'm gonna have to check that. If not, I think the other one is. And then the AMG GT3. Who do you think will win? Here are them, or here are the cars lined up, and they are ready to race. Lane four, again. GP two thousand nine. It's now time for us to pick the next four. How about ourselves a 510 wagon? Whoa, look at what we got here. This is not the swap one. This is not the wheel swap version, you see. This is the original one. On top of that, we have ourselves a Scion FRS in blue. Look at all that blue in the camera. Aren't you blued up? Just kidding. Next we'll have Loopster with his hands up and whatever this car is. Valkyrie. Who on earth do you think will win it? Here they are lined up and ready. Lane number three, and it goes to Valkyrie. Looks like we have a magician in here. They still swap the boxes around. Well, it's still time to pick four. Number 10, Vaveline Pontiac Stalker. The new version of Iron Man, or newer version of Iron Man. Rocket Fire, and a blue version of the Nissan Skyline GTR BNR32. Who do you think will win it? The cars are lined up and ready to race. Lane number four, it goes to Rocket Fire. Time for us to pick out four more cars, or four more vehicles. Sunnigan. 
Plymouth Fury. Prototype H24 and Ray. Who is going to win this? It's time to see which one of these four are going to cross the line first. We're going to lane number two here. And it looks like Ray is going to get it. Time to pick four more cars. Hair splitter for splitting hairs. L O L O L O L O L. 95 Mazda RX 7 with some Japanese decals on it. Then Maximum Leeway and Katana. Who do you think will win? It's time to see who is going to win this. Lane number two again. It's going to go to a character car, Katana. Looks like we're picking out four more cars. MST Suzuka. That was quick. CC9 Charger 500. Seventeen Ford GT. And then Captain Phasma. Who is going to win it? Right, the guys are ready to race. Okay, now we're ready. Lane number four again, and it goes to a fantasy car by the name of MST Suzuka. Congratulations on getting your win. All right, it's time to pick. The second to the last group of four. McLaren P1. Aventador Mirror Homage. Escape Brigade. And the First Order of Flame Trooper, I believe, is called. Yep, it says that, if you can't really see. Once again, who is going to win it? Let's find out. They're all lined up and are ready to go. Going to lane number two here, Flame Trooper. So far, there's been a lot of character cards that have won. Well, guys, there's only one left in each of these four boxes, so I'm going to dump them out one by one. First up, we have Lando. Let's see if I can get the name right. Calrissian. I know I call it Clarissian for some reason, but it's Calrissian. 
Yeah, Lando Carasian. Next car up is. Oh, somebody likes Sinistra. Got my got, got myself another Sinistra for you to see. Next one up is. O9 Corvette ZR1, a gift pack exclu uh, um, exclusive. And finally, we have a ticker cab. Who is going to move on to the next round? One of these four cars are going to move on to the next round while the rest of them go into the losers or the losers pile. And we get yet another character car moving on. Calrissian. Here is how round number two is going to look. Start from the top. Working our way all the way down to the bottom. Only two realistic cars have moved on. That's the 57 Chevy and the Indy 500 Oval. And also, one, two, three, four, five fantasy cars have moved on. Well, the rest are just character cars. Character cars are dominating. Real riders, obviously, they're real riders. So, yes. Round number two is coming up next. It's time for round number two. Here are your first four. Lane number three, and automatically we have a character car moving on, Mal Maleficent. Here are your next four. All right, lane number two, 57 Chevy, got lucky that time. All right, y'all, second to the last group of four right here. It's time to see who will get the win. Fouling lane number one. Although it's not a real rider's car, this is a fantasy vehicle. GP 2009 has gotten a win. All right, now finally, here are the last four. It's time to see who will move on to the semifinals. Lane number four. Lando Calrissian. Yep, I got it right. Lando Calrissian. It's a two on one on one affair. Two character cars, a realistic and a fantasy car. One of these four or, or no, two of these four are going to challenge to become the winner of the Fatal 4-Way Weekly Race. And one of them will become the winner when the semifinals happens right now. It's the most favorite time of the Weekly Race Series. It is time for the semifinals. Two of the four cars are going to move on to the finals. It's time to see who will be that first one to do it. Oh, Lord, takedown right there. Maleficent was not so maleficent after knocking into that little spot. But we do see lane number three, and it's going to be the GP2009. It gets the win. 
Here we are. Three cars remaining. One of them is going to get a spot for the finals and will take on GP2009. It is time to see who will get the honor. Wow, talk about heartache. Maleficent is out. And Lando Calrissian is out. But our beloved 57 Chevy decided to make it happen. And he is going to win. And he is going to challenge GP2009 to become the ultimate winner. Will the new guy get it done? Or will the oldie show him how it's done? GP09, 57 Chevy, finals, next. All right, guys, we made it. Here it is, your finals. GP2009 and 57 Chevy, both cars have dethroned the remaining two character cars. But now they have to face off against each other to claim superior dominance in a best two out of three run. Here is the first run. Lane one, GP2009 gets the win. If GP2009 wins this, that means that him and his whole brand of Hot Wheels is superior. But if not, the 57 Chevy will have to win this in order to force it into a third run. Oh boy, look at that, lane number two, which means in a squash style effort, GP2009 has shown the new guy how it's done. The 57 Chevy was a great contender. But all in all, he wasn't able to get the job done. Despite him just being bought a couple of hours ago. But what a performance from a new car that is going to get added into my massive collection and that'll do it for today's hot wheels weekly race i hope you like this video thumbs it up comment down below if you are brand new watching this be sure you subscribe and also turn on the notifications bell as well well it's your boy chris cage and i'm coming at you two times and we will see you at the next video thank you all for watching